Well, now to another Thanksgiving tradition at the fairgrounds where crowds packed the grandstands to watch the ponies run. And most were also dressed to the tee. As photojournalist Adam Copa shows us, women's hats were all the rage. <laughs> This is a tradition. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. It's sort of like a mini Mardi Gras with a more family aspect. There's a tradition that you do before you get with your family. You come here, you watch the horses race, you dress up, and then you go and you start your Thanksgiving. We um, always come to the racetrack in the morning to watch the races, and then we go home and eat. We take every excuse that we can get to dress up. I'm excited to be out here and put on my finest hat. <laughs> I've got a turkey, <laughs> a baked turkey on my head. I think the types of hats worn are probably uniquely New Orleans, you know? I mean, we like to make our own things. Each year I go a little bit bigger and a little bit more bizarre. Um, I enjoy seeing what everybody comes up with. Last year I felt underdressed without a hat on. I love the reaction. I mean, if, if I didn't want a reaction, I would dress in a t-shirt and blue jeans. Because you get to dress up and it's not Mardi Gras, it's much more relaxed and laid back and it's fun family time. The great hats, the wonderful outfits, and uh, the positive attitude. Everyone just comes here to have a good time and uh, it's a blast. Still ahead, they lost everything.